in this we'll see how we can copy files from our remote system to our local system so let's log in let's log into uh, our remote system I had run some let's say you have run some simulation and your files are stored in let's say this particular folder right these many files have been generated there are a lot of files so for example if I want to copy this particular file back to my local system how do I do that so for that you don't need to be logged into your uh, remote system let's first log out but copy the name of this file first or you can what you can do is get the it is let's just check the directory at which this is present it's at home TV Prakash IBM C sim and so on and the file that we want to copy from the remote system to our system is this particular file so let's first log out and then the command that you use for copying is called SCP you need to enter so what you need to enter is uh, SCP followed by the user ID at the IP address of the workstation colon and then the direct uh, the path where your uh, file is located so it's if I recall correctly it's at IBSC sim see cases then oscillating then computer is slow Okay, so, so oscillating 7 and the name of the file is I've copied that right and I want to the destination to which I want to copy is my documents folder so I write documents and enter so it has started copying the file at 127 kbps speed and if I go to my documents do ls i can see this file file is in fact here right you can look at it if you want right so this file has been copied to my system so this is a way in which you can copy if you want to copy entire folders what you need to do is simply add a command add an option called scpr and then instead of the file name you specify the folder name here right and then you'll be able to copy a folder thank you for watching I hope it will help you with your research work.